Hi. Hi. You know, it occurs to me that I don't want to go to heaven. I want to go to hell. Maybe I should back up on that. A few days ago, um, or all the time, um, I was really depressed. I was walking around inside my own head, looking out through my own eyes, trying my best not to trip over empty smearing off ice bottles and crumpled up Asian skin magazines. I have shitty malt beverages and Asian porn in my head. I was just trying to hold it together. I was trying to hold together long enough to where I could get home and masturbate and fall asleep in a pool of my own tears. Um, and I wasn't even sad because of anything worthwhile either. It wasn't like a friend died because I don't have any. Or my cat had been run over. It's just your usual fed up and lonely blues. I was at a point though where I was actually wondering if uh, dying passing on would really, you know, be all that bad. I mean, think about it. We're all in a race from the cradle to the grave. Some of us are faster than others. Not my grandmother. From the moment we're born, we're just heading towards an end. So why not take some initiative and, you know, try and win? Besides, there wouldn't be any questions left to ask because you'd finally have the answers. However, would I truly be pleased? I started to consider heaven and hell and what might be there in each place. I looked at what everyone has classically told the weird shit, the meta, even Dante. I mean, we're talking about the afterlife. I figure it's open to a lot of debate. For the most part, though, there were some pretty consistent themes. Heaven's a white... That's not lit. Um, heaven's a white, I don't mean Caucasian, place. Lots of clouds, lots of robes, lots of harps, and your family and friends are there. Well, none of my friends, because I don't have any. Um, hell is red or black. 
I don't mean African American. There's fire, lots of being naked, lots of pitchforks, and no one you know is there. Now, for the most part, hell sounds not good. But consider this. In heaven, you have to spend eternity with your family. I can't be the only one instantly frightened by that idea. I don't like spending holidays with my family, let alone extended periods of time. And now you're talking about forever? I'm already dead, so it's not like I can kill myself again. I, could you imagine having to get your ass chewed out by your mom for eternity? More than that, she's in heaven too, so you know some of her housefrau friends are there too. Jesus Christ, the universe would implode from all the passive-aggressive questioning. That's why I think I want to go to hell instead. Or at least spend the weekends there. No, 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 hear me out. In hell, no one you know is there. Awesome. Um, at, every day, you can meet new and interesting people. I'm sure Hit, Hitler's got a lot of cool stuff to say. I bet Jeffrey Dahmer could tell me a few interesting cooking recipes. Um... You know, you can get acting tips from adulterers, financial advice from Jews. I'm just telling you what I read. Um, everyone there is naked. So there's no having to guess how someone looks when they're, you know, nude. Plus, if what I heard is correct... That's where all the sexually active people go. And, I mean, wouldn't that be where you want to be? I mean, not that I'd necessarily do any better. But, that's uh, a much better shot than I've got up here. <laughs>